According to CDC, the risk for severe illness of COVID-19 increases with age. With this, age-based quarantine restrictions were implemented by the Philippine government between May to October 2020, where an elderly aged 60 and above were barred to go out, affecting their work. However, elderly were not only susceptible to the virus, but also to the decline in mental health status, as revealed by the study of Save the Day in 2019. Therefore, although these measures could help mitigate disease transmission, its simultaneous effects can also impact psychological well-being that must never be disregarded. So, in this quantitative descriptive study, researchers aim to identify the demographic profile of the respondents, determine the extent of effect of quarantine on the psychological status of Filipinos aged 60 to 64 and NCR, Region 3, and 4A, where highest records of cases have been reported, and determine the correlation of demographic variables to the psychological factors. To do this, the researchers developed a survey questionnaire with the help of a licensed psychometrician. This was beta-tested before being deployed officially to social media sites. Relatives of the respondents or legally authorized representatives were also contacted to guide the elderly, and emergency hotlines were also provided for safety. Upon treating the data with percentage weighted mean and ANOVA with correlation, the results were as follows. Out of 300, 43.4% of the respondents were from Central Luzon, 37.7% were at the age of 64, 60.3% are female, 53% are married, 43.3% are living with their spouse and children, and 59% were self-employed before the pandemic. Amidst the pandemic, 59.7% have become unemployed and 61.3% reported having a monthly income of less than 9,520 pesos. Most of the respondents doesn't have health issues two weeks before the survey, although 32.3% did have minimal body pains and 6.7% reported having a chronic medical condition. The extent of the impact of quarantine confinement on the respondents psychologically was measured in terms of the psychological factors, motivation, attitude and beliefs, and socialization. Data shows that quarantine has affected the motivation and attitudes and beliefs to a very large extent while socialization was affected to a large extent. The psychological factors were also significantly correlated to four demographic variables, location and employment status to socialization, age to attitude and beliefs, and motivation to health status. Again, although quarantine could help mitigate disease transmission, it evidently has an impact on the psychological well-being, and thus the Philippine health system must develop and provide mental health and psychosocial support which is accessible to everyone, especially the elderly.